The Edo State All Progressive Congress APC Chairman Jared Tenebi attempted to vote at a polling unit 6 in Ikaibo without a voter card during the ongoing governorship election. Although his efforts were thwarted by electorates who insisted on proper identification, preventing him from casting his ballots. In a viral video seen by many, the confrontation resulted in chaos at the polling unit, highlighting ongoing tensions regarding vote buying and voter identification in some parts of Edo State. The Edo APC chairman, Jaret, Jaret Tenebi, wanted to vote at Unit 6, Ika Ebi, Ika Ibo, without a voter card, but was prevented from doing so by electorate at the unit, as seen in a now viral video. And a lot of persons condemned this move by Jaret Tenebi. Some even noted that some APC party agents were seen bribing voters with cash of 10,000 Naira at Idumoka Primary School Polling Unit, Ward 1, in Igwibe local government area. And some other PDP party agents were seen gifting out cash gifts. Voters halted the accreditation and voting process in the Ikoba Army Children 6 polling unit in Etwa Ward. In Ipoba local government areas, INEC officials arrived without the official stamp and so many irregularities that took place in some polling units. Even at a primary school in Aroromi Primary School in Akoko Edo local government area, some political talks tried, you know, disrupting the voting process. And there have been irregularities and reports of heavy vote buying in the ongoing uh, Edo State governorship election. But then, luckily for the people, um, Jared Tenebi was stopped as he tried to cast his vote without his voter card. Guys, this is the same man that went on national television, on Arise, on, on, on Arise TV, to say that Edo people do not have money to purchase DSTV, that Edo people did not have DSTV to watch Arise when they asked him why the APC candidates couldn't appear on Arise to, you know, hold interviews at least to present his manifesto to the people. This is the same man that mocked Edo people that they do not have money to buy DSTV to watch Arise TV. This is the same man, a whole APC chairman, going to a polling unit without his voter card, and he wanted to cast his vote. This is really unfortunate. Indeed, it is. It is. Because at this point, you cannot cast your vote without your voter card. How can you go and vote without your voter card? How will you be identified? What are they going to add? As in who? What is your identification in a polling unit without your voter card? It's just like saying you want to go to a bank to cash out money without your check. This is really unbelievable. And this is coming from an APC chairman. Had it been it was from other political parties' agents, they would have raised the alarm. And had it been Nigeria is a serious country, he would have been arrested for this attempt. Had it been that those people did not stop him, he would have gone ahead and cast his vote without his voter card, which is, which is, it's, it's an offense. It is indeed an offense. But I'm not surprised. So long as it's coming from the APC, I'm not surprised. This is a move that is being made by some APC chieftains. And that is just it. Nigerian politicians, they will never cease to amaze us. They will never, never cease to amaze us. This is lawlessness. Lawlessness at its peak. I wonder what happened. Is it that he misplaced his voter card? That he couldn't take his voter card to his polling unit? Like they said, I don't know be Lagos. 
This is the highest form of impunity. But I guess the people stopped him when they noticed he tried voting without his voter card. Now let's take reactions from Nigerians. If it was from another party, they would have arrested him and charged him for treasonable felony, which is their slogan. APC Mongo Mongo Party, always in the business of some controversy. APC and Togri are inseparable. This man said the people do not have DSTV to watch TV. How many? How is voting without a voter card possible? Maybe he has no DSTV to watch. He is supposed to get arrested. How can a whole APC chairman go to a polling unit without voter's card and he wanted to vote? One can vote without his PVC as long as he is a registered voter. If your name is on the INEC register placed on the wall, you can copy your serial number and give it to the APO to insert in the Beavers machine and get accredited. Okay, very good. How can he vote without his voter card? I am not an APC member, but then, with the level of damage and, and hardship caused by the APC government, I never believe that APC will get up to 50 votes in a do. This really means that Nigerians are not tired of suffering. If I hear Regan after this election, now slaps on I will take. The people where I they talk to know themselves. You do not want to hear they have rigged do make on keep the same energy of this happiness till results will come out. He should be in prison by now. He should be arrested. Okay, guys, these are reactions from Nigerians. So this is what's happening in Nedo State. And in fact, the elections have been uh, are concluded and we are already seeing results online. And some of these results from different polling units shows that the APC are leading in some polling units, like uh, some polling units in uh, Isako and other local governments showed APC leading, while in some other polling units it showed the PDP leading in some other polling units. So, but that of the Labour Party, you know, it's not really given. I mean, we so far the results shown shows that the Labour Party is not getting much votes as anticipated. So the political parties getting much votes is the PDP and the APC. So it seems that this election is is mostly between the PDP and the APC in Edo State. So I'm dropping here, guys. Kindly share your thoughts on this in the comments section. Thank you.